Hey guys, welcome to the 2 a.m. pipe on the patio. Had a great day today. Had the uh, pipe meetup, the San Diego Pipe Club meeting. It was a good one today, man. We had 15 guys there. Oh, it was a great, great meeting. Everybody was sharing tobaccos. I want to thank uh, uh, Reed Bender Bud, who brought some uh, Squadron Leader Special Reserve for me to try. That was some good stuff. And also Larry, who brought some uh, Margate so that I could try that. Uh, man, that was, that was some good stuff, boy. That was a... What a great bunch of guys, man. If you live in San Diego and you smoke a pipe, every Sunday between 2 and 5 at Liberty Tobacco on Claremont Mesa Boulevard, just a great bunch of guys gets together. And uh, just an incredibly welcoming bunch of guys get together and smoke pipes, share tobaccos, uh, if, you're, if you're a new guy looking to start smoking a pipe or you've just started smoking a pipe, they're more than willing to answer any questions, share their knowledge. It's just a great group of guys, man. And, and the age ranges are from in, your, in the 20s to old guys like me um, and older. And uh, just great, great guys. Just it's an incredible group of people in that in that in that club, man. And it, I'm just so thrilled to, to be a part of it. And truly great guys. Every every single one of them is just a nice guy. Some of our YouTube, our YouTube members here are, are group members of that. Smurfinelli, 33. Uh, Reed Bender Bud is a member of it. Um, San Diego Piper, he's the president of it. And uh, uh, Grateful Dog is a member of it. Just an amazing group of guys, man. Every every Sunday, I'm just blown away by the the generosity of these guys and the, the generosity of their time, of their knowledge, uh, and the generosity of of their their tobaccos. They'll share tobaccos with guys. If you, you know, if you're a new guy and you're not sure what you like yet, you know, there's there's always aromatics. There's Englishes, there's Virginias. You can pretty much try all the different stuff. See what you like. Find out what what you're what you like. You know. And uh, it's amazing. I'm just blown away by this this group. Today was today was fantastic. I got to stay extra long today. I picked up some. tobaccos today. In fact, tonight I'm smoking my uh, Oceano, Savinelli 320 Oceano, and in it I am smoking some Peter Stokovy, you probably can't read that, Peter Stokovy's proper English. The first time I've tried this, and um, it's amazing. I'm really loving this. I have a great time every time I go to that pipe club, man, and I just come home floating. I'm just, you know, 
I, I just can't truly express uh, how I feel when I get home. I just, it's like just such a good time and such good camaraderie. Just a wonderful atmosphere, welcoming atmosphere to new people. Um, everybody welcomes the new guys in. You know, it's like they want you to succeed at, at smoking your pipe. They want you to have the same enjoyment from it that they have. And I, I think that's just amazing. This tobacco is a... Little, little wet. I should have probably let this dry out a bit, but I was kind of excited about it. So I did my uh, first pressing of English tobaccos, and I uh, took that out at the at the pipe club meeting out of the press and uh, it came out great, it came out so good. Um, and I was just blown away by how good it tasted. And uh, <clears throat> So I'll be doing a lot more of this press. I'm probably gonna do a video, I'll probably do a video and actually edit it so that I can do the whole process of how I do the the entire pressing process with the with the noodle press from start to finish and uh, I'll probably do that over the next week I will do that uh, video and put up a how-to video on here for you guys and, highly recommend you it's fun it's it's interesting it's fun when you the way I do it when you're when you're all done the the the, the puck of tobacco comes out completely wrapped in parchment paper when you pull you know push it out of the tube and it's wrapped in parchment paper and you have to unwrap it to get it out so it would be a great way to store tobacco, um, I think. Um, but uh, it was fun to do. I only, the English that I did, I only pressed for two days and it came out so hard I had to use a knife to cut pieces off of it. But if you leave it, you know, in the in the air for a little while, it becomes a crumble cake. Over a couple days, it it loosens up and becomes more of a crumble cake. You don't have to use a knife with it. Um, I did a block or a, a puck for um, Smurfinelli 33, and it was like it was real hard when I took it out. But over the three days, it became a crumble cake. So, but it, the press works awesome. Works fantastic. So I may start doing that. Much more. Especially if I get a like a vacuum sealer and then I press it and vacuum seal it. And it comes right out of the press when it's real hard and just vacuum seal it and that will keep it nice and fresh for storing it.
but this proper English is fantastic. You guys that, that recommended proper English to me, thank you so much. Um, I also got another one that uh, Larry from the Pipe Club recommended called uh, Tory, T-O-R-Y, and I don't know if that's a, uh, um, it was a bulk at the, the b and I don't know if that's a house blend or if it's something that can be ordered on, you know, from another place. I'll have to look it up, but, but I did get some of that too. And I got some uh, pirate cake. And some Mississippi River. The regular Mississippi River from Seattle Pipe Club. But I encourage you guys to look for a pipe club in your area. And I hope that your pipe clubs in your area are as welcoming and uh, fun and entertaining and educational is, is the ones that, that I have in my area because man the one at Liberty Tobacco in San Diego the San Diego Pipe Club is just amazing truly amazing just incredible and uh, all the guys there Jim Paul, Larry, I'm going to miss guys, Neil, um, uh, Sebastian, uh, Bud, all those guys are amazing, man. Just, uh, All of them are great guys. I will talk to you guys later. I am just going to sit back, relax, think about my day, and enjoy the rest of this bowl. Y'all have a good week. God bless you.